Hey, what's going on, people? It's another steamy July day, July 25th. My name's Reagan the Doom Wizard. Please support this content as I continue to document the decline of civilization. We'll begin with Mr. Scott Duncan. Meteorologist from Scotland based in London puts together really exciting graphics. You can find him on the Book of Faces and Instagram, perhaps. He uh, really you know, just showcases it here on his, you know, feeds, puts the, puts the information together, easy to see, uh, really har har you know, harrowing stuff, uh, North Atlantic temperatures, world, you know, just really puts it all together, like I said. Back to the news, front page of New York Times. Heat records are broken around the globe as Earth warms fast. Climate disasters daily, welcome to the new normal. Climate talks chief, who also heads oil companies, says world must attack emissions everywhere. This bloke, the head of this year's United Nations climate talks Thursday, called for governments you know, to tackle it, you know, to, to must be brutally honest, blah, blah, blah. We're not taking accountability for uh, any scope of emissions, let's be real. But apparently, you know, his words, Al Jabber, are going to get things moving along. Meanwhile, Governor Inslee calls for climate action. Earth is screaming at us. Global temperature shatters records. I mean, the headlines all over mainstream media. Two-thirds of the nation right now are under extreme heat alerts, heat deaths. It kills. I'm sweating right now. It's even got up to around 90s. Still not as bad as Texas. Marine heat wave causing waters along Jersey Shore to be warmer than usual. Also, uh, apparently, the coast... The waters off the coast of Florida are near 101 degrees, bath water temperatures. Experts are raising concerns. Whoop-dee-doo. Nobody cares. And you're sick of hearing about the heat? But the scientists, don't even look, don't even look at them, are saying the numbers paint the story of a warming world. The heat wave that we are have experienced the hottest June and now July on record. It was now confirmed to be impossible without climate change, but luckily we have German women, the uh, MAGA types that drags radical climate activists by her hair for blocking traffic as public's anger mounts. Get up, the woman demanded as she screamed at people from the last generation and Greta Thunberg, there she is, uh, got Fined and arrested in the past week. You know, it's just, we lost control. That's the name of the video. We lost control. Opinion piece. Uh, that seemed to disappear. If you really want to get the breakdown, like I said, climate and economy. Puts it together. About climate records tumbling. Um... T temperature, I mean, not just by a little bit, we're just like breaking, you know, by a huge margin, we're breaking records, and uh, even next year is going to be even warmer, Heat sauce. and wildfires, there's like large number of wildfires out of control, and hit with hailstorms and tornado, and there's uh, flood and storm damage in New Jersey, just literally everywhere, um, it's the climate apocalypse, Forget the climate casino, it's the climate apocalypse. And we can't defeat it by, we can't, hear this headline from Fortune, we can't defeat climate change by investing in a handful of countries. We need to come together at COP28. Ah, same old song and dance I've been reporting since 2020. It's been a fail. Needs to come together to find a just energy transition. Investors are too focused on a handful of large companies, warns the UAE's climate envoy and executive director of the IEA. But don't worry, Jordan Peterson's coming there soon. 
to the UAE to talk God and stuff. He just said that on Bill Mayer. You can go watch a whole podcast interview between Bill Mayer and Jordan Peterson. Opposite ends of the ideological spectrum. Drink and smoke. Mainly Bill Mayer is drinking and smoking. And talk about how good Jordan Peterson looks after despite dying. Alright, again back to Scott Duncan. I just keep saying this. Maybe I need to delete my comment. That's a good idea. I'll do that on live. Anyways, a little too harsh. Uh, because we're toast. I mean, you know, average low temperature even in Phoenix. Look at this, 114, 109 in Rome. Not just a little, a lot. A lot. Like it a lot. I mean, just seeing this amount of change in the past few years of keeping track with this, you know, paying attention. Yeah, he's a normal dude. Um... Morocco, 119 degrees. You can go through this. Now we're in it. We're in full-blown environmental collapse. And I didn't even mention, I didn't even mention um, in my video, my five-minute montage, is like, biodiversity loss and nuclear meltdown and, you know, coral reefs dying. Like, there's so many break off effects of all of this breakdown going on all right i wanted to get this across i'm going to do something fun after this and post some memes but here's your flash briefing july 25th have a beer on me i'll talk to you later realists see ya mm -hmm.